Hi friends, good morning to all. Today we are going to discuss rule of 9. Uh, this is one of the standard formula that we are using for calculating the total body surface area of burns. In the previous video I have discussed the type of burns and in that I told we will discuss the formula for calculating the total body surface area or the percentage of, uh, of the body affected the burns. The rule of 9 is uh, we can use both in uh, children and adult but there will be a little variation uh, uh, variation of percentage in adults and uh, uh, compared to child okay so we will see how the percentage is uh, coming for each uh, body part if you are calculating the one side of hand that is 4.5 percentage and the back of the hand is another 4.5 percentage so total one hand is 9 percentage so two hand will be equal to 18 percentage is that okay then the head the front area of the head in the picture you can see it's a clear one it will be easy to remember when we'll study along with this picture the front area of the head is considered as 4.5 percentage and the back is 4.5 percent so total is 9 percentage the total head then the anterior part of the chest that is 9 percentage then the abdomen that is 9 percent the, the total back of the body is 18 percent so the total front of the body between the neck and the uh, lower part of the abdomen that is 18 percentage then the back area is 18 percentage so total this one 36 percentage so 9 percentage 9 percentage 9 percentage 18 80 so we have finished the upper half of the body then the lower half is the one entire leg is 18 percentage which means the front part of the leg is 9 percentage and the back part of the leg is 9 percentage in the same way another leg so total both legs is 36 percentage is that okay then the perineal area 1 percentage when we will calculate it will come 100 percentage so like this the rule of 9 calculation in an adult when we will compare to when we will come to a child see if the entire head is 18 percent in an adult we told it is entire head is 9 percentage but in a child it is 18 percentage and the hands is same in the upper and lower part of the body also 18 and 18 percentage then the legs there will be difference one leg one entire leg is 14 percentage okay so total two legs will be 14 plus 40 28 uh, percentage in the um, adult it was 18 plus 18 36 percentage so the difference will come to uh, adult and child is the head and the legs okay so this is the percentage of total body surface area based on rule of nine we have uh, some other uh, methods also for calculating the total body surface area the one is lung and blood method in that one uh, we will uh, that is not commonly using but in that also an exact method for calculating the total body surface area in which uh, the uh, body will divided into smaller anatomical part and each part carries particular percentage of total body surface area based on that we will calculate and the another one is palmar method in palmar method we will use the palm area of the client excluding the fingers for calculating the total uh, surface area of the uh, burns in that palm is equal to 0 0.5 percentage of the total body surface area that also we can use for all age of clients okay so these are the uh, common methods for assessing or calculating the body surface total body surface area in a burn client this uh, I will show you these pictures this will be more clear for you so we will see one question how, based on the percentage that we studied how we can calculate in a question scenario the first question an adult client arrives in the emergency department with the burns to the both entire legs okay both entire legs and perineal area using rule of nine the nurse should determine that approximately what percentage of the client body surface area has been burned 
So the question is very simple. They told a client come to the emergency department and the client taught the entire two legs is burned, has burned and the perineal area. So in the previous slide we studied that if the one entire leg is equal to 18 percentage. So total two leg, entire two leg will be 36 percentage. And one more thing we should add in this scenario is perineal area. We told that in an adult patient the perineal area is considered one percentage. So this is a fill in the blank questions. Total how many how much will be the total body surface area? The percentage. I hope you got the answer. 18 plus 18 36, 36 plus 1 is 37 percent. This is a simple question. I just wanted to think or clarify how we will calculate. We'll see one more question. Okay. In this one, a client is triaged in the emergency department. Okay. The report provided to the unit nurse, the burns unit nurse, states that the client has second degree burn over 45 percent of his body determined by the rule of nines. So here also we are using the rule of nine formula. The burn unit nurse anticipate which possible scenario to equate with the 45 percentage of burnt area. So in this question, they just make it upside down. The previous question, they told these are the areas and calculate the percentage. In this one, they give an approximate percentage. So based on this percentage, out of the options given, which one will be, which one can be matched to this particular percentage of total body surface area. We'll see. The first one is entire right and left legs. We told one leg is 18 percentage. So if total both right and left leg will be 36 percent. So we can eliminate the question. They ask 45 percentage of total body surface area. Then the another option entire right leg and right arm. The entire right leg is 18 percentage. So 18 plus right arm is total 9 percent. Entire right arm. So 18 plus 9 is 27 percentage. So eliminate the option. Then the next option, entire right and left arms and anterior thorax. The right arm is 9, left arm is 9, total 80. The anterior thorax is, they only mention the anterior thorax. So that is, we told the, the chest and abdomen together 18. So only the anterior thorax will be 9 percentage. So here 9, 9, anterior thorax 9, 3 into 9 is 27 percent. So eliminate that. We have only one more option. So that would be our answer. Definitely. See, entire right leg, 18 percentage. Okay. And right arm, 18 plus 9. How much? 27. Then anterior part of the chest and abdomen. We studied this full area. This upper anterior uh, abdomen and anterior area is 18 percentage. So how much we got? This total 18. This one 9 to 27 and another one is entire right leg 18 so when we will calculate how much 18 plus 18 36 36 plus 9 45 so done so is that clear i hope you are very clear with rule of nine you can expect some question based on this rule of nine might be they will not ask you some questions like a direct like this but there will be a percentage like this uh, this is the 45 percentage of total body surface area how much amount of fluid you should infuse for this patient for the first eight hours or for the first 24 hours uh, like this will be the question will be interesting so on the next video we will discuss how to calculate the uh, fluid based on the total body surface area and we'll study parkland formula okay bye for now